Welcome to my channel Engineering Concepts. Today in this video we will discuss what is an instrument cable and what is its purpose. How to select an instrument cable. What are the major parts of an instrument cable. What are the major characteristics required for an instrument cable. What is instrument cable shielding and why is it required. What is the purpose of instrument cable shielding and how can it prevent noise. What is an instrument cable and what is its purpose? Instrumentation cables would transmit and receive analog or digital signals in the control system. Basically, the instrumentation cables would transmit digital and analog signals to and from the sensors and the equipment. Mostly these cables would operate at the voltage levels of 24 to 110 V at 4 to 20 Ma current rating. We need to isolate the instrumentation cables from the external electrical interferences. There are many types of instrumentation cables and we can see these cables in different industries mostly in power generation, petrochemical industries, and a lot more. These cables would connect the control room to the plant area. Then from the field junction box to the measurement or actuating devices. How to select an instrument cable? Mostly, instrument cables are selected according to their source impedance and according to this, we could use this for the required process. Certain instruments have very low source impedance and there are also instruments that have very high source impedance. We must also consider if the cable is used for high level or low level signals. High level signals would be between the range of 6 to 50 V while the low level signals would be below 5 V. Signal wiring must be made up in twisted pairs, mostly solid conductors should be used so that there won't be any degradation of signal because of broken strands that could occur in stranded conductors. How to do the instrument cabling? It must be kept as short as possible it must not create any obstruction which would prevent the personnel or traffic effects the cabling must be done in a way that must not restrict the maintenance activities it should be kept away from the fire risk areas it should not be placed in areas where spillage could occur or in places where vapors or gases are present. Mostly these cables consist of a conductor on its center and it would carry the current from the source, separated by insulation from a surrounding shield. The surrounding shield is the current return path that is required for the cable to complete the circuit. All these components would be augmented by an electrostatic shield in order to reduce the handling noise and also there is an outer jacket for protection. What are the major characteristics required for an instrument cable? Good insulation features it should have good electrical properties and it must be flexible to noise resistant flame retardant heat resistant oil retardant. What is the instrument cable schedule? The instrument cable schedule can be considered as a document that has a list of instrument cables. This document consists of cables and glands which is needed for each instrument connection. Details in the instrument cable schedule, cable type, cable number, cable specification, cable size, cable length, description of the source and the destination cable gland and also the size of each cable. What is instrument cable shielding and why is it required? As we mentioned above the instrument cables are used to transmit the signals to and from the control center and the entire plant. So the complexity of the industrial process is huge and due to this transmission of process signals to long distances is needed. So the major problem which could arise in this situation would be the electrical signal noise. The electrical signal noise can be described as an unnecessary voltage or current which would be created in the signal leads, or by an external source mostly it could be from the adjacent wiring or from the equipment.
Instrument cable shielding can prevent the signal noise. What is the purpose of instrument cable shielding and how can it prevent noise? Instrument cable shielding is done to prevent the electrical noise which could be because of the external or internal sources from affecting the transmitted signal. It would also reduce the electromagnetic radiation emission from the cable itself. Shielding is mostly composed of metal braiding, metal tape, or foil braiding. If the shielding is properly done then it can reduce the noise coupling. A shielded cable assembly could also feature a grounding wire called the drain wire. Shielding would prevent the electromagnetic noise, it would prevent it in two ways. The first is by reflecting the energy and the second way is that it would pick up the noise and conduct it to the ground. Shielding would maintain the integrity of the signal in a highly noisy environment secure communications the major purpose of the shield is to conduct to the ground in case it has picked up any noise. How to select an instrument cable shield material? It should be selected according to the shielding effectiveness flexibility flex life we must consider the ease of stripping and termination mechanical strength corrosion resistance temperature requirements must be considered. What are the factors that must be considered while doing the instrument cable shielding? The conductivity and permeability of the shielding material physical characteristics of the shield such as thickness and number of openings shield grounding should be considered which could be at one end or both ends, or at multiple points strength and frequency of the time varying magnetic field. 